Hi, Paul from Power Wash Store. We're gonna show you today how to use the Pudor ball valve system for the high volume, low pressure uh, applicator system. What you'll see here is we have two sets of valves. We have a, a large set and a small set. The large set here is your suction valves. That goes to the inlet of the pump. And the small set is your bypass valves. Currently, all the valves are currently closed. Uh, if we're gonna start, let's say we're on uh, chemical. Okay, we're gonna have the valves open for our chemical line, our chemical line, or in this case labeled tank one. Okay, we're gonna come over to our unit and when we're ready to start it up, what we're gonna do is we're gonna flip the lever over to bypass. We would start our unit up and this, I'm not gonna run it just so you can hear, but we're gonna start it up. We'd let the unit run to uh, suck the chemical in and go into bypass until the, the unit is completely primed where all the air is out of the lines and out of the bypass line, and when we're ready to operate, we'll flip the lever back over to operate. When we want to switch over to the water tank from the chemical, here's what we're going to have to do. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to shut the unit off. We're going to come back over to here. We're going to close our chemical tank and open our water tank. We will not change the bypass valve at this point in time because we want to get the chemical out of the pump back into the chemical tank. We'll come back over, we'll flip the lever over to our prime mode on the UDOR system. We'll start it up, we'll let it run for approximately 30 to 45 seconds, which will suck water out of the water tank into the pump, and you'll see the color change in the bypass line where it puts the chemical back into the chemical tank. Once I see water coming out, I will shut the unit back off. I will come back over here. I will close my bypass line for tank one. I will open my bypass line for the water. I can come back over here. Again, I'm still in the prime mode. I'll start the unit back up. I'll let it run for uh, 45 seconds to three minutes, depending on how long it may take to get all the air out of the system. Once all the air is out of the system, I can switch it over to my operate mode, begin spraying. You'll have a little bit of chemical that's left in the line, but you won't be putting uh, chemical in your water tank. Now, when I want to switch back over to chemical, it's a much easier process because we're not concerned about a little bit of water getting into the chemical. What we're gonna do, the first thing we're gonna do, we'll shut off our unit. We'll come over here, we'll close the water bypass and open the tank bypass, close the water suction and open the tank suction. We'll come back over here, we'll flip it to prime, we'll start the unit up, we'll make sure the air's out of the system. Once the air's out of the system, we're ready to spray. That's how you use the uh, ball valve system for the Udor high volume low pressure applicator system.